is Coach Walker, and I just wanted to welcome everybody to spring practice 2010 and kind of give you a brief overview of what we're looking for and what we're expecting and uh, give you some highlights of uh, the future. Um, the first thing is, is is what we're trying to get out of spring practice. And number one, we want to find out who who's gotten better in the off season, who's, who's not, um, kind of start working on our depth chart. Not necessarily who's won, but who's kind of in the mix. Who, who has physically or mentally matured enough to be able to help us on Friday nights and who still needs some opportunities to do that in the weight room or, or otherwise. Um, that's kind of our approach to spring practice and, and what we're looking for is, is just finding that group of guys that, that we, can, we think can help us in some capacity on Friday nights uh, in order to get our football team back in the, in the playoffs. Spring practice begins next Tuesday, uh, May 5th, and um, it, ultimately the finale will be the 14th uh, at 7 o'clock here at uh, the Eagles Nest with the red-white game. And um, hopefully this year, barring too many injuries, we'll be splitting the teams up and having a draft and, and actually having a real game with officials. And So that's always a great way to end the spring and, and, and lead us into our summer program. Uh, this spring, you know, we, 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 we make a lot of goals as a staff, and, and one of the goals for our offense this spring is is to really improve our passing game, and, and that doesn't just necessarily mean our quarterback play. It means everything, our protections, our route running. Uh, we want to be a more balanced team, and uh, we've been very limited um, for a number of reasons um, in our passing game in the past, and, and we really want to improve that. We feel like if we can do that, we're going to help our chances on Friday night. So. Uh, this spring, our major goal offensively is we've got to replace a lot of young kids, a lot of graduating seniors on the offensive line, and um, but more importantly, we want to really develop our passing game this spring. Our goals defensively are to get back to basics, and uh, that's really what our off season's been about. But we've got to make sure we do a great job. Uh, focusing on running to the football and tackling. Um, sometimes you get caught up in scheme too much and, and trying to trick people. And the bottom line is if we don't learn how to tackle better and run to the football and play with a great bit of tenacity and, and uh, violent aggression, then we're not going to win many games. So we really want to focus on getting back to the basics, our kids understanding what we do. Uh, at times last year we, we got a little complicated and uh, we kind of have a saying, if you think, you stink. And so we're trying to make sure our kids aren't out there thinking that they can just play, run and hit, and uh, do the things that we know we need to do defensively. Our, our emphasis as special teams will be on our coverage units. Um, you win and lose games a lot of times on uh, our kickoff coverage unit and our punt coverage unit. And we'll spend a lot of time and not really working on the, the aspect of punting or kicking it as much as covering it and staying in lanes and getting off blocks and squeezing the football and everybody understanding who's in charge of leveraging the ball versus spilling the ball and those types of things. So our focus this spring will really be on finding those guys and that gets back to my original statement of finding the guys. It, you don't necessarily have to earn a job as a starting linebacker to make the varsity team. If a guy can cover a kick or a punt, He's going, to make, he's going to have that opportunity because that's just as important as anything we do. My hope is that, that as fans and supporters of our program, you guys are excited as we are. We've had a great off season. Kids have gotten bigger, stronger, and faster. A lot of kids have grown up. And uh, I hope, hope to see you at the uh, spring tailgate before the spring uh, red and white game. Uh, and check back. Uh, from time to time as we as we experiment with this video blog and uh, try to keep all of our fans updated on the great things that are going on here at Milton High School.